February is here and Cupid's arrows are flying. And this can only mean that it's time for my top 10 finds of February. So let's get started and I hope you make a love connection with one of these Amazon finds. First February find will be a heart. How can you not fall in love with this gold heart hand statue? So cute to decorate for the month of February. It would look really cute if you're doing a Galentine's or even Valentine's at your house. If you had a little tray or dinner that night, this would be such an adorable focal point. So spread the love with my first Amazon find of February. Now, I know many of us are planning trips or starting to travel, or maybe you're even traveling for some of the holidays coming up, and you're not gonna wanna leave home without this mini iron. Because of the different wattage switch on this mini iron, it can be used worldwide. The mini iron can fit in the palm of your hand and it also has a non-stick surface so it can get the wrinkles out of any different types of fabric. It is so small and compact, it can seriously fit in a pocket of a suitcase, a backpack, or a duffel bag. Happy travels with this mini iron. For my number three February find of this month, this for sure blew my mind slightly. I don't even know why. I'm always looking for an easier way to pack my many different toiletries and keep weight out of my bag. So meet my new toiletry dispenser travel finds, shampoo and conditioner, but they can do a little trick. You guys ready to see? They're excellent quality, they are so easy to refill, and they will last you for years and years to come. And the fact that they're magnetic and stick together make them really easy to pack. Speaking of packing in this video, this toiletry bag is really amazing. It holds so many different items and it lays flat while it's open so you can see all of your different makeup, skincare, and toiletries that you have available. It's high quality and beautiful and I just recommend it for your travel. My number five favorite find of February will be these stem glassware holders. These these have an anti-skid rail, so when you pull one glass out, the other glassware does not topple over. So you can place smaller glasses underneath, charcuterie boards, trays, and other mini bar items. I thought this was a fun find for February. And my number six find is extra special and cute. You can really put anything in these ice molds, but I chose strawberries because they're red and they go so well with champagne. So once you have the ice tray all set and frozen overnight, the great thing about this idea is if you do not have cold champagne or you forgot to chill it, you just drop one of these ice cubes into the glass, pour the champagne and you have ice cold champagne. And of course you could do this with any drink, whether it be wine or a cocktail or a mixer, these ice cubes are just fun and put that extra special little touch on Valentine's Day. Speaking of wine, for a number seven find, you have to see this wine opener. I'm gonna admit, when I first went to use the wine opener, I actually pushed the button the wrong way and I thought, this thing is a piece of junk, it doesn't even work. When I actually pushed the right button, I could not believe how perfectly this took out the cork. Once the cork is removed, you actually hit the other button and then the cork comes completely out. This is such a much easier way to open wine, especially older bottles of wine. I'm putting two finds into number seven because I feel like these two things just go hand in hand. Once you get the wine opener, you're going to need this new simple pour aerator. Once you have the wine open, you just put this right into the bottle, touch of a button to start the pour, touch of a button to stop the pour. And there you have it, a fun, festive way to serve your wine to guests or just a night in. So we've already covered decorating for Valentine's Day. We've covered really fun drink ideas for Valentine's Day. So of course we have to cook. But cooking can be fun with this new ceramic detachable handle set. The set has the detachable handle, which makes cooking so much easier because you really don't have to deal with pot holders. You can just move hot pots and pans around with the detachable holder. These are non-stick and can move safely from the stove to the oven, to the table, to the dishwasher. So if you have to cook, I honestly can't think of a better pot and pan set that just does it all. And it also nests in drawers, taking up minimal space. For number nine, this new find for not only Valentine's Day, I don't even know if it's really Valentine's Day find, I'm gonna call it February and beyond. Have you ever seen anything so adorable? Okay, I think that this is gonna be like the it girl thing, like all the it girls are gonna have this in their apartments. I'm like married with kids, so I don't know if I would call myself an it girl, but I have this dice face. For whatever reason, this dice face now reminds me of Vegas. We went to Vegas a couple weeks ago for my birthday and I lost everything on the crops table. I only bet like $50, but I still lost all of it. So for number nine, make sure you pick yourself up the vase of the season, the dice vase. Number 10 fine, I have to admit, I wasn't sure what to expect when I opened it. Once I started to thumb through this book, 
it made me cry. It's actually the love book. It's by National Geographic. This book really reminded me just the simplicity of love. Simple love between siblings and friends. Maybe it's more of a complicated love, like a love you don't know if it'll work out or not. I think my number 10 find is absolutely my favorite this month. It would be a perfect gift idea. Beautiful coffee table book. And it's such a good reminder to keep love simple. Okay, and there we have it. That's February, the month of love. The month of you want it to be springtime, but then you realize you basically have the whole winter left. So then you just start decorating your house with pink and just hope that spring comes soon. So wishing you all a very happy Valentine's Day, a happy February, and join me next month and I will be covering another top 10 Amazon finds.